Lesson 2. In this lesson, we meet ten new roots from which we shall be able to build many new words. These ten roots are vive, life, parole, speak, shine, seem, comprehend, understand, long, long, felice, happy, lodge, dwell, star, stand, mult, much or many, and labor, work. We also learn, first of all, two new endings. The first of these is the ending E, that is the English letter I, which is the sign of the infinitive. The infinitive in English is that form of the verb which is preceded by the little word to. The other ending is a, English letter E, which signifies the adverb. Let us now repeat the words in the first section. You will say them after me, and then I will give you an English version. We'll begin now. Vivi, to live. Logi, to dwell. Labori, to work. Paroli, to speak. Stari, to stand. Vivi longe, to live long. Logi cune, to dwell together. Labori longe. to work for a long time. Paroli longe, to speak for a long time. Stari longe, to stand for a long time. Vivi cune, to live together. Cun vivi, to live together. Labori cune. To work together. Cun labori. To work together or to collaborate. Paroli cune. To speak together. Cun paroli. To speak together. Stari cune. To stand together. Kun stari. To stand together. Multe labori. To work a great deal. Multe paroli. To speak a lot. Stari multe, to stand a lot. Vivi felice, to live happily. Cun logi felice, to live together happily. Labori felice, to work happily. Paroli felice. To speak happily. Felice stari. To stand happily. Vivi bone. To live well. Logi alte. To dwell high up. 
Labori bone. To work well. Bele paroli. To speak beautifully. La gepatroi vivis lange. The parents lived for a long time. La infanoi cun laboras felice. The children collaborate happily. La viroi cun parolos amike. The men will speak together amicably. La gesignoroi logias bele. The lady and gentleman live well. La ge amicoi staris longe. The friends stood for a long time. La patrino parolos longe. The mother will speak for a long time. La feliciulo laboras multe. The happy fellow works a lot. Mult parola virino. A talkative woman. Parolis mallonge la signorino. The lady spoke briefly. Laboros malmulte la malbonai infanoi. The bad children will work little. Convivis malfelice la geamicoi. The friends lived together miserably. La vivo estas mallonga. Life is short. La vivo shinas mallonga. Life seems short. La viro shinis paroli. The man seemed to speak. La infanoi shinis malfelicei. The children seemed unhappy. La gesignoroi laboris malmulte. The lady and gentleman worked little. La infanoi comprenas malmulte. The children understand little. Malgranda compreno. A small understanding. La viroi comprenas. The men understand. Comprenas la amicoi. The friends understand. La junulinoi comprenis. The girls understood. La junuloi staris alte. The young men stood high up. In the next section, we learn the next five numerals. You remember, we learned uno, du, tri, quar, quin. Now we are going to learn ses, sep, ok, now, de. And two other useful words. Ankau 
meaning also, and anstatau, meaning instead of. Ses infanoi, six children. Sep viroi, seven men. Ok yunuloi, eight young men. Nau amikoi, nine friends. Dek signoroi, ten gentlemen. Ses viroi, kai sep virinoi. Six men and seven women. Ok viroi kun nau virinoi. Eight men with nine women. Dek viroi sen virinoi. Ten men without women. Dek viroi sen virinai. Ten womanless men. Infanoi an statau gepatroi. Children instead of parents. Infanoi ankau gepatroi. Children, also parents. Circau dec infanoi. About ten children. Circau dec anstatau du. About ten instead of two. Oc patroi, cun circau dec infanoi, Ancau oc viroi sen infanai. Eight fathers with about ten children, also eight childless men. La granduloi parolis an statau labori. The big men talked instead of working. La patroi parolos an statau la patrinoi. The fathers will speak instead of the mothers. Ancau la maliunulinoi shainis compreni. The old women, too, seemed to understand. Longe cae multe la bonuloi laboras. Long and much the good people work. Now, in the next section, we come to three new Suffixes. These suffixes are m, meaning inclination to, ad, which indicates continuity of action, and ets, which means abstract quality. Let us try the words in that section. First of all, the words with M. Parolema. Having an inclination to speak. Talkative. Comprenema. Having an inclination to understand. 
understanding. Laborema, having an inclination to work, industrious. Vivema, having an inclination for life, vivacious. Parolado, means a speech, the continuity of speaking, speech. Laborado, might be called toil, that is, continuous work. Vivado, continuity of life. Logado, the act of dwelling. Starado, the act of standing. Altezzo, the abstract quality of height. That is just height. Bellezzo, the abstract quality of beauty. That is beauty. Bonezzo, goodness. Grandezzo, Bigness, unezzo, youngness or youth, longezzo, length, multezzo, multiplicity, felicezzo, happiness, malfelicezzo, Unhappiness. Malmultezzo. Rarity. Mallongezzo. Brevity or shortness. Malunezzo. Oldness or age. Malgrandezzo. Smallness. Malbonezzo. Badness or evil. Malbellezzo. Ugliness. Malaltezzo. Lowness. Vivezza. Lively. Virezza, manly or virile. Infanezza, childish. Amichezza, friendly. Patrezza, fatherly. Signorezza. Gentlemanly, malamichezza, hostile, unezza, youthful, parole mulo, a man with an inclination to speak, a garrulous man. Malparole mulo. A man with an inclination not to speak. A taciturn man. Parole mulino. A chatty or talkative woman. Malparole mulino. A taciturn silent woman. Laboremulo, an industrious man. Mal laboremulino, a lazy woman. Senamichezzo, 
this quality of being without friends, friendlessness. Sen laborezzo. The quality of being without work, unemployed. Sen infanezzo. The quality of being without children, childlessness. Sen patrezzo. The quality of being without a father, fatherlessness. Cunezzo. Togetherness. Lo già di cune. To stay together. Convivi amichezze. To live together amicably. Con laboradi amichezze. To collaborate amicably. Paroli signorezze. To speak disdainfully, perhaps, that is, with the quality or in the quality of a gentleman. Longe paroladi. To make a long speech. Staradi longe. To stand for a long time. Compreni multe. To understand much. Bonulezzo. The quality of being a good guy. Malamichezzo. Hostility. Felicia di cune. To go on being happy together. In the next section, we meet pronouns. These are me, I, li, he, she, she, G, it, ni, we, vi, you, ili, they. And in addition to the pronouns, we have two more useful little words. Pri, meaning about or concerning, and said, meaning but. Mi parolis. I spoke. Li laboras. He works. She staros. She will stand. G vivas. It lives. Ni comprenis. We understood. Vi estos. You will be. Ili shinas. They seem. Li parolis pri laboro. He spoke about work. Ili parolas pri la vivo. They speak about life. Si parolas pri la amikinoi. She speaks about her girlfriends. Li parolados pri bonetso. He will speak about goodness. Vi comprenis 
pri la parolado. You understood about the speech. Ni con vivos amicetse. We shall live together amicably. Ni logiadis cune cae cun laboradis amicetse. We lived together and collaborated amicably. Mi staradas longe cae li paroladas signoretse. I stand for a long time, and he speaks disdainfully. Anstatau paroli. Instead of speaking, ili longe laboradis. They worked for a long time. Ili logis cune cae vivis longe. They dwelt together and lived for a long time. Ni laboros longe cae ancao parolos multe. We shall work for a long time and also speak a lot. She laboris multe, said vivis felice. She worked a great deal, but lived happily. Li belle parolis, said laboris mal multe. He talked well, but worked little. Lage signoroi logas bele, cae ancao vivas bone. The lady and gentleman live well and also live well. You will see that Esperanto distinguishes between these two identical English phrases. Sed ili shainas mal felicei. But they seem unhappy. Vi parolas anstatau labori. You are talking instead of working. Ni estas felicei geunuloi. We are happy young people. Si estis bona maliunulino. She was a good old woman. Vi parolos anstatau ili. You will speak instead of them. Circao dec infanoi logis cun la gepatroi, cae ili cune vivis felice. About ten children lived with the parents, and they lived together Happily. Ili parolas mal multe, sed comprenas multe. They speak little, but understand much. Now, in order to make our pronouns into what are in English possessive pronouns, in Esperanto, we add the adjective ending A, as follows. Mia amico, my friend. 
via infano. Your child. Shia patro. Her father. Lia altezzo. His height. Ilia bellezzo. Their beauty. Nia unezzo. Our youth. Gia grandezzo. Its size. Iliai patrinoi. Their mothers. Shiai infanoi. Her children. Liai paroloi. His speeches. Miai laboroi. My labors. Viai paroladoi. Your speeches. Giai gepatroi. Its parents. Niai infanoi. Our children. Miai bonai infanoi. My good children, viai belai amikinoi. Your beautiful girlfriends, liai longai paroladoi. His long speeches, shiai virai infanoi. Her male children, Gi malmultai bonetsoi. Its few good qualities, Niai queen malbonai infanoi. Our five bad children, Iliai malgrandai infanoi. Their small children. This is the end of the second lesson.